Check it, check it, checking the microphone, motherfuckers. Checking <coughs> the microphone. Um, hello, lovely, gorgeous human beings. Um, uh, this would normally be the point where there was um, a recap and stuff um, and intros, but I, I haven't made one because I'm uh, I'm lazy. So we're going to just go straight into it. So there, uh, it might take a little while, so, so I'll just put up some clips while I just uh, get SNES 9X loaded up and stuff. Wait, come back! Motherfucker! Classic. It's not even on! The fucking dare it, what the fuck? Um. I say this, I bet I can find the fucking thing, where is it? I downloaded it and got working last session, where, where the... Bastard bumps has it gone. It's this. Ah, motherfucker! I've got a tank! What are you gonna fucking do now, bitch? <coughs> oh, it's okay, I found it. Dick brick hard like a metal. I got three holes for it like a pretzel. Tight as a virgin boy. Don't get me nervous. I'm here to serve you like customer service. I saved it. Thank you for I whoever bought me food and thus um, interrupted me CPR. doing this. Yes, I put my mouth on it like CPR. Let's make porn and watch on VCR. Anything goes. Jesus Christ. This doesn't stop. Okay, right. I think we're there. Thank you, Nix. We start. Why is this a clip? This shouldn't be a clip. It's just a fucking intro sequence. Who the fuck made this a clip? I need to delete this clip. Thank you. Can't wait. Japanese curry. Beautiful. Right. Um, we're gonna go with this way as the as the background. I think. I still haven't got a proper overlay. One day I'll I'll get an overlay. Had to rescue a dog real quick, Haley. That is absolutely fine. You you rescue that dog, fam. <laughs> Someone always beats the food, Brooke. Well, that's okay. It's all good, I should say. Okay, um, temperature specific window, window, this. Right, work, you bastard. There we are. Now, is the, but let's just make this a bit bigger. Is that all right, or is that too small for people? Yes, he is the best boy. I think we actually did thingy, didn't we? If I remember rightly, we've been using the uh, the save thing, haven't we? Load game position, back zero, slot zero, which I... Th actually, I think we just do F1, don't we? There we are. So, you may remember. But uh, last time, our hero, Randy, that's the guy with the crazy hair at the top there, um, was... Uh, um, oh, Nikki, I'm glad you know this game. Brilliant. Was... Um, was expelled from his village after he drew the infamous mana saw. <laughs> You're good, Eden. Don't worry. Um, and uh, and he had to. Uh, but Gemma, the knight, um, played by Idris Elba, told him that he now has to uh, restore the mana saw because he's the one who drew it. So shit. 
So they took him to the water temple where he, on his way, he met, uh, he met this young lady who rescued him from a bunch of goblins, um, whose name is Prim. Yep, the two heroes of the game are called Randy and Prim. Do, do what the fuck you will with that. Prim's being played by Daisy Ridley and Randy is being played by Tom Holland. Um, they met, he also met Dylok, who happens to be Prim's boyfriend, um, who is being played by Taron Egerton. Go on, lad. And, uh, and fight, um, on his way to kick the ass of the witch at nearby and then um uh and met looker the water sage played by sigourney weaver at the water temple she told him basically yeah Gemma's right you're gonna have to um you're gonna have to restore the mana sword um and had him restore the first of the mana seeds the water seed by holding a stone up to it which is pretty easy nice um Gemma then told him to go to Gaia's Naval, where he needed to... Yeah, it's literally called Gaia's Naval. Where he would find a dwarven blacksmith, hopefully, who could restore the... Um, who could reforge the sword with, for him using the orb that the monster that he killed dropped. Uh, and then on his way, he went, back, he went via Pandora, where he met this young lady, Prim, again, um, who was having a fight with her dad because she was telling him he can't marry Di- she can't marry Dylok. So um, she ran away and joined him and said, we're going to the forest. We're going to the um, dark forest where the witch is and we're going to beat her and get Dylok back because her dad deliberately sent him off there to get killed, apparently. Um, so we tried to do that, but we couldn't get through because um, there's something in the way and we need to get like a big axe or something like that from the Dwarven Blacksmith. So all roads now lead to Gaia's Naval. That's where we are. That's what's happening. You are now up to date. And we, we are currently in a little village known as Kippo. Oh, yeah, so we also met um, Nico on the way, who's uh, played by Dan John Jules, of course. Because he's a cat. Um, I don't... Do I already have elbow pads? Just have a look and see what I'm equipped with. Hang on. Because it wouldn't be the worst idea spending some of this on some more shit. Okay, yeah, you got that. Got the leather overalls, nice. She's got the kupu, kupau. Both got wristbands, which are not as good as the elbow pad, I don't think, so. Maybe let's upgrade. Oh, we could get a chain vest, couldn't we? She's not wearing a ribbon, so let's give her her ribbon. Let's get a chain vest. Possibly should have bought a couple of wishes, actually. But yeah. Also, I uh, to anyone who has played the game, like Nikki, this is um, obviously this is the original recipe, so to speak. We're not playing the um, the the remake um, because that already has voice actors. Shit, wrong person. Um, no, but hang on, we didn't change Randy's armor. Leather overalls are a bit shit, so I put on the chain vest. Heyo, indeed. Sell the old armor. Not this worth much. Yeah, the remake's lo- lovely by the looks of things. But, um... But yeah, because the point of these celebrity streams is that I do uh, um, is that I do the voices of the characters as uh, impressions of famous people. Um, it just didn't make sense. Sorry, I'm trying to remember the fucking bloody things. There we are. Okay. And then you put that on, and then we're in business, right? Okay. Right. Good. Of this village is Gaz Naval. It's a cave where the dwarves live. Apparently, Kippo is uh, is in Yorkshire. This is Kippo Village. My son Dalek is so busy, he never comes back to visit. Even though we're so close to Pandora. I heard that Pandora's in trouble.
Check, check, I think we're back, I think we're back, I think we're back. We are back, motherfuckers. Oh shit! That wasn't meant to happen. And you've got hand cam, motherfuckers. Hello there, Fee! How are you? This is my house. You can got a wife upstairs. <laughs> Ew. My husband has so many brothers. Sometimes I know who's who. We should probably cast the Cannon Brothers, actually. Because we're going to be seeing them a lot. Um, they're all, play all played by the same person. Um, didn't prepare this, but let's do a poll anyway. Actually, no, no, what? We'll do it. We'll do it when we next go to one. But yeah. Jed and his brothers. Uh, uh, yes. Yes, it is an idea. Thank you, Nikki. Sorry about the uh, adjustment to the microphone there. Mary Rose! How are you, sexy? Eh, shop at my dad's store, okay. Alright, let's go. Right. Now, we could probably do with bashing a few more things as we, uh, as we go around, because, you know, we are a bit under-leveled. We haven't done any grinding because it's a cinematic playthrough. At some point later, um, we may start doing what we did with... Uh, um, sorry, it's an evil mushroom boy. Um, what we did with the Final Fantasy streams and Final Fantasy VI and uh, and do occasional grinding streams in between the uh, the the plot ones on Sundays. As it is reasonably easy to grind in this game. Piss missed. Okay, never mind. Got that. This is the wrong way. Yeah, so many lovely, little, so many little guys, so many little guys. Just gonna do this one more time. One second. There you go. That should be a, a good um, bit of sound there. Do 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 do. The soundtrack for Secret of Mana is spectacular. Remember, this is 16-bit sound you listen to here. It's such a good job, but yeah. Oh, I bet that is going to be fit that lasagna. I believe we're all, oh hang on I've just realised because she's got level 1 of that but I haven't used it yet so we might as well switch around you take the sword I'll take the knuckle lusters so I think I've got the uh, yep we can both move up to level 1 but yeah this is actually um, you may notice the uh, the script is a little different though Nikki this is a uh, there's a fan um, translation because the original Ted Woolsey translation um, again cut a lot of stuff and censored a lot of stuff. This um, has the uh, um, this has restored it all, plus taking advantage of the fact that it's a ROM to mean that it can be um, the file, basically the file size can be bigger than was allowed on a cartridge, thus more text can fit into the game. Um, because in the translation they had to cut a lot of the, the, the dialogue. Um, down because basically more um, well you know you can fit more in Japanese on a screen in Japanese than you can in English basically back in the days of those kind of cartridges it was a thing 
But yeah, it, it's good. Um, so far, it's it's really good, yeah. And then in, uh, I believe in the remake, they restored a lot of the planned content that was originally planned for the game. Um, this was originally planned for the Super Nintendo CD, which of course never happened. Um, probably not a bad thing either, it would have been quite rubbish. But, um, so they had to trim, they had to cut a lot of the stuff that originally wanted to be in the game. That's all been put into the new, uh, into the remake, into the 3D remake. I will be buying and playing that game at some point in the future, possibly on stream. No, Basil, do you have oregano? Oregano will do just fine. Lasagna. And uh, this is one of the easy, best places for grinding, actually, because these things just keep coming along, basically. Don't have either. Well, shit then. Is what, what, what herbs do you have? Do you have any herbs at all? I'm glad you're best a bit sleepy. Though you should probably go to bed. Now, she's got to level one of that. Let's get her to level one of the... Uh, which button is it? Damn, I'm getting the hang of this. The spear, there we are. Parsley. Okay, that's not going to do it. Um, so, you got some options. Essentially, you're going to have to go fusion food on this, or get. Yeah. Ah, mates, Oregon. No. Oh, no. Um, you got a few options. One, you get someone. Or you just... I mean, the good thing about a sauce, a red sauce, is you can just leave it on to simmer. So you can put it down to really low while you go and get the um, oregano and basil. It is ironic sleepy, but that's okay. The second option is you go fusion food on it and you make it taste different. Don't go for an Italian-style lasagna. for you, dude. Yeah, so run to the store, put it onto a low simmer and run to the store. Fucking balloon. Oh, my phone's in view, that's not a good idea. Bitch, will you go down there and kill that fucking bat before it balloons me again? Oh, no, okay, fine. I could have switched to her. I've got, I keep forgetting I can do that. That's the only answer. Exactly what Haley said. More simmer time will just make it taster, tastier. Add a little bit of extra water to it, and then just go out to get, and get the stuff. Or alternatively, you could add some your holy trinity. I can't walk. There we are. Be a long weapon. We can change back to the sword now as well, actually, because we got to level one of the. Um, thing. I really like the way weapons work in this game. There are instead of having to constantly buy new weapons and shit. There, um, there are eight weapons, and you just um, upgrade them basically the whole way through. Time, you could work with time. Um, 
I mean, what I would go for, what I would do without them would be, I would, Nikki's ahead of me here, I would go for chili flakes, smoked paprika and cumin and just go with a slight, you know, um, basically you're pushing for the umami and it tastes slightly kind of like a Mexican lasagna in that regard, really, or, Sp or Spanish, but I think it'd be quite tasty. Yeah. Exactly. Kind of spice, okay. Well then yeah, forget the chili flakes, go for um Go for cumin and smoked paprika then. Or like I say, just just do your stuff. Do it! It's still gonna be good, mate. Do it your way. We know you're a good cook, Mary Rose. Whatever you come back with will be, be awesome. Eight. So you can basically, yeah, just... Just wait and you get more slimes and just carry on with this forever, basically. Easy way to grind up. But... However, we are about to get one more character, and I don't think they will start at a level representative of what level we're at, so probably don't want them to be too far behind us. Ah, yes, we're about to get an item that'll do us well for the rest of the game, as far as I remember. I miss it here, you can't get it otherwise. Let's keep my, uh... MAGIC rope. This is an item that will allow us to teleport out of any place we like. Um, of, of any dungeon, basically, back to the start, so it's a, it's a quick escape. Not doing very well here, am I? Why is he avoiding all my hits? He's got it's a dex, basically. He's got lots of avoidance, whatever it is, dodge. Oh, yes, mushrooms do have hearts on them. We'll meet some friendly mate ones eventually. Yes, get on the page in the Discord. <laughs> you don't have to do if you don't want to. But yes, I do have a Discord. Um, you can anyone can get update. You can get updates on the Discord no matter what. You just go there and it'll tell you whenever I drop stuff. Um, but if you're a patron, you also get access to a whole pile of channels and shit. Twitch subs also get access to the Safe Work channel, but nothing more because obviously you can be bought a Twitch sub. Um, so it would be possible for under 18 to get in that way, and we need to be careful. Exactly what Brooklyn said. Yeah. Plus, you get all kinds of good shit in the Patreon. Special seasons. Why not? Yep. Um, you'll get access to my um, YouTube audios a week early, um, and higher levels you'll also get me um, reading Pride and Prejudice, reading Shakespeare's sonnets and uh, 
Shelley poems and videos of my dog. There is even a high tier where you can get a letter from me, handwritten letter each month. There we are. And now we're able to go in. Properly go in. Right, where are the dwarves all going to be from? had Edinburgh so we can't go there. Um. Right, you vote for what voice we're going to be using for these. I've gone with Barbados rather than Jamaica, Gabe, but that's available. Castle, those were good, uh, good ideas as well. Go to the next one. These are all things we can have in the future. We will be casting two new characters soon. Thank you. Let me go get that now. Barbados. We're, at, we're actually doing Barbados, are we? Okay, right, fine. Barbados. 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 Okay. There's a sound coming from a place way deeper than here. Maybe something's digging a hole. Yep, Costa Cambrook. Oh, that's the same place, hang <clears throat> My oh my, did you come from the surface? A while ago. Sprat child supposedly washed all the way down here from the surface. They've been putting on a magic show. This is the village of the dwarves. Uh, oh, Mary Rose, you are such a lovely little potato. Lately, there's been a lot of earthquakes. See, there it is again. Kind of scary, ain't it? This is where the blacksmith is. The palace around here. Come on now, guy. It's been buried for ages. Right, this is Watts. That's, he is a dwarven blacksmith who will be travelling with us for the whole game. He's not a playable character. He's a big name NPC. Who is going to be playing Watts? We have a few choices. Okay, 
two more possibilities. Um, think. And finally, yeah, let's go there. Already got two minutes, people, to vote for who is going to play What's the Dwarven Blacksmith. Not Hugh Jackman, no. Australian actor wouldn't have been the worst of ideas, actually. <laughs> This stage was dangerous. Oh, it's a, there's a big battle going on there at the moment. Three possibilities in the lead. We got all tied up. Plenty of time left to vote. Get in there, do a vote. Remember, you have to press the vote button afterwards. Oh, we have a leader at the moment. Of course, an art story. Let's have it. Be what clinches it then, Gabe. Jason Statham, it is the Jason Statham, Jason Statham, 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 Jason Statham, Jason Statham, 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 Jason Statham, Jason, Jason Statham, Statham. Okay, we can do that, no problems. You show me that sword. See here? It's in terrible shape. If you leave it like that, I'll break apart. Name's Watts, the infamous blacksmith. I can reforge and fix that sword for a hundred GP, okay? Yes, please. I must decline. Okay, wait here a minute. It's reforged and repaired. You know, I've never seen such an excellent sword. I definitely advise you to keep it in good shape, not get it all rusted. Just look at it, it's be rare to go. Man, I'd love to forge a sword like that someday. Whoa, what's happening? No, oh, it's pouring out my hammer. No way. Is that the mana sword? How about that? I can't believe this. Do you think it's possible that some of the sword's sacred power has taken up residence in my hammer? You know what I'm going to do? It's a test. I'm going to make an axe or something with this. Come out later, would you? I've had that one. Um, I just thought it would, it's just a way, because it's a, it's a four by three game and it's just a nicer way to do it. I just thought that audio was good. Right, what you got? Ah, power wrist. Everyone needs a power wrist. Spiky suit though, I need more. Probably gonna need three power wrists eventually when we get the other dude in. We'll come back to that in a moment. We 
new sword is now called the Defender. I believe it actually has a thing, doesn't it? Yeah, quality and evasion rate increases. None of those do anything, though. Um, we do need to equip the thing on us, though. Yeah, not that much better, but it'll do. Hey there, man beast. No, just had that one already. Oh, we need to go see the show then. I think that's all there is left to do, which means we're about to cast another character. Oh, sorry, I forgot. We have Barbados. Ho oh, ho, welcome to the dwarf village. I guess you've seen the magic show next door. Many unusual things in the village. Hope you take a look around. Ho oh. It is weird, yeah. This, this, this particular track is a bit repetitive and annoying, I'll be honest. Yes, welcome to the dwarf village's Hut of Spectacles. Well, now I'm just the director of the Hut of Spectacles. I wonder if you'd like to see the show. The magic show can be seen for only 50 GP. The show is about to begin. You're about to see an exceptionally mysterious Rabbit Man. Take one Rabbit, take one man, it's Rabbit Man. Fake! Get off the stage! Huh? A hawks? We have a heckler! Expected from an audience with a keen eye for quality. Then I guess it's time to show this incredibly rare, authentically infa ineffable sprite child. Right! Who is gonna play the sprite? This is our third P and final PC. So let me see. And it could, we could go basically either, um, I don't think the sprite's gender is ever really established, so. The sprite's name is Popoy. It's kind of a seem male, but I'll, I'm going to do you a mix of male and female characters, actually. Female actors, anyway. Um, so, let's start with... You know what, let's bring Danny back, why not? He'd, he'd do the job quite well. Um, let's have... Exactly, Jamaica, not Barbados. Uh, what was her fucking name? Yep. Uh, bum, 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 bum. Sorry, I should have prepared this in, uh, ahead of time, but, you know, deal with it. Frankly. That's <laughs> all I can say. Um, let's see who else we could think of for this role. Oh, we should... Yeah, actually, you know, that's a good point. Um, well, that's a good choice. That's a good idea. Um, how about... Oh, that's a good idea. Um. Actually, both those guys would be a good choice, so let's go with that. Okay, here we go. 
There's your choices, people. I wasn't spending my time earlier very well anyway. You're right, Ty. Recording an awesome script by an awesome writer. There you are. There's your two choices. Get in there, people. Oh, wow. I think we've already got a winner. I think we'll be casting anyone else in this session. I could be wrong. I think we're probably good there. Truly from one of the best good writers, yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. It's, it's, it's flipped. Popoy needs to be played by the penguin. I think that's probably what we're doing. Oh, God, do I need to try and get my... Try and learn how to do him as the penguin? Okay, right, hang on. Danny DeVito, Danny DeVito, Danny DeVito, 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 DeVito. Okay. Let's see if I can... Danny DeVito. Danny DeVito, 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 Danny DeVito. We're going with Danny DeVito anyway. Yeah, no, he's too he's too fierce as the penguin. I wouldn't do for Pop Boy. Okay, right. We'll just go with uh, standard Danny. Oh, kindly big Oh, ki Danny DeVito, DeVito. Oh, kindly big brother, please help me. Oh, sorry, he's doing it in the voice. Oh, kindly big brother, please help me. Is it, is it not dreadful or gentle audience? Listen up and de and you'll tear up. Speak and you'll tear up. A teary, tearful, terrible, sad story. This poor child has, got, has over 50,000 GP in debt. We're getting the money back little by little. We hope someday it can all be repaired. Come on, friends. I know you have big hearts. It's a donation 100 GP go a long way. Whatever. <laughs> yes, thank you. I'll take that right now. But you can just hurry up and go home. So rude. Davido, Danny Davido. <laughs> How'd you like that? The strength of my performance. That guy was about to cry. Come on, my storytelling was pretty good too, wasn't it? <laughs> I think this will be, be a profitable venture. Oh, did you hear that just now? Oh no, please forgive us. This child really is a sprite child. Up until recently, he probably lived in the sprite forest. But at some point, he was swallowed by a flood and carried off here. I thought we could earn a travel expense for a way trip back home. Then against my better judgment, well, someone got an idea. What? A gifted genius! Tell the genius I am! Listen to this. Would you apologize to? <sighs> okay, I was wrong. How many travelers did you manage to fool? Tell me. Uh, actually, you're the only one who fell for it. Dot, dot, dot. I'm ashamed to have taken part of your ruse. I'll return your money. Start a blast. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Um, it does fit. There's no excuse. Really messed up. <laughs> okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, right. Out we go. Oh. 
What's going on? Something's coming! Boss battle! This thing sucks. Maybe because it's really hard to actually find a place we can hit the fucking thing. Them, yeah, I mean, essentially, I, I gave, yeah, I gave both, uh, I gave both ones possible because, well, any one's possible, more to the point, so that you could, uh, do it, but. I think, yeah. With Danny DeVito playing him, I think we can probably assume that Popoy and our version was going to be male presenting, at least. Oh, piss. No, oh, bums. Need to use some candy. Wait for it. Wait for the right moment. And now. Whilst I haven't sorted out her thing, have I? Oh, no, not that. Get the hang of this eventually. Oh, that, oh, God. Which bloody button is it? There we are. The reason it says weird shit I played as a kid at the top is because we were use this is the background that I was using when uh, when we were doing some of the old Amiga games and going proper retro. Um, I'll have to bring that back sometime soon. Just going to check I haven't been stealth delivered food. This has happened particularly from this place. Oh, also, um, you guys might like to know that Badger's Venom audio just dropped. This guy didn't butt in. I could have taken it on myself. Why are you little... I'm really sorry. When this child was washed up here, he forgot everything from the shock, including his name. There are some who grumble about these antics, but the sprite is actually a very thoughtful child. Hee <laughs> Well, my memories will return somehow. Just be patient in the meantime. That thing should have been sealed off. Yep, tea. Always tea. Sorry about that, Gabe. Okay. In the palace of the depths of the earth, it was an ancient monster that literally grew up feeding on poison. Hmm. You might be able to get in from where it broke out. If you receive power from the mana seed, your memory may return. What? In that case, I'll definitely go. I'll leave right now. Can't go by yourself. Palace has been sealed for some time in the festival monsters. But our new friend is brave enough to defeat a monster like Tropicalo. Randy, is there any way you could bring this child? To the palace at the depths of the earth. Take the sprite to the palace. So grateful. Did you hear that little one? Listen to what this fellow says. Sound good. And if you haven't heard it yet, I do have an Astarian audio out. Don't get in my way, big bro. Bro? I'm Randy. 
Hmm, well, why didn't you give me a name? I don't make things more convenient, right? Yes, I will call you Popoy. Thank you, Gabe. I'm a little disappointed with how um, how that one did. I really thought it was gonna um, be quite a popular one, but hey, whatever. Oh boy, well, whatever. Nice to meet you, big bro. In my canyon, we've got all three, and he comes with a freaking uh, thingy. Thank you, Nikki. Appreciate it. Comes the boomerang. Right now, where do I go now? Oh, I have to talk to him again, don't I? Good luck. Normally you could get to the palace through Tropicana's tunnel, but long ago, Erenice, the witch of the north, placed a lava barrier that spans the entrance, sealing it off. First you'll have to go try to ask her to dissolve it for you, but she probably won't. Back in the day, she used to be a good witch, but... Anyway, you'll have to find her in the phantom forest up north to see what happens. This is about a bow that washed down here with a lot with the little one. Oh yeah, we got bow as well. Please take it with you. Speaking of weapon, seems like Watts was looking for you. You should stop by and see him. Right, we're gonna have pretty much all the weapons at this point almost. Crystal orb? What are we supposed to do? The elder said the witch of the north used to seal half of the palace. Then we'll have to go ask her to dissolve it. Yes, they are all NSFW. Yes, that's what the plaps are. The plaps are, um, yeah. Also, the script for the Venom audio that, um, Badger dropped was written by our very own, um, uh, TT, Crypto Cutler. So do check that too. Hey, I tried making your axe, but it didn't turn out too good. I wonder why. Hey, by that boomerang. Could it be that... <clears throat> Try all that axe, would you? Just as I thought. See, if I don't have this sword here, I can't get its power. Even though this axe is small, it can smash a boulder. It's mighty special. You want it? Yours for a hundred. Hell yeah. Not copy, cryptic cuddler. Um, TT. Just quickly do a retweet on that thing. Hang on. If you get any other mana weapons, you should come back. The only way you'll have it, you'll get energy out of weapon orbs is for me to forge a weapon with them. Oh yeah, let me show you where the shortcut is. They are also awesome, yes. Use this coming and going for the surface to be much easier. Now, we'll also do our spear, because we got the... Right, what shall I fall for today? Because we got a spear's orb. So now we get the bronze spear. Now, in the meantime, between times... Time to level up all these other weaponry. You know what, just, yeah, let's leave her on that and go to level two. Oh, and Nico's here, of course he is. Yeah, we've been in strange places, Per Something you need? Nico obviously played by Danny John Jules. Personalized service of busy travelers. I can also save for you. Remind me what the 
I don't want to fuck this up. I'm pretty certain it's a F1 to say, but it's, it's shift F1, but I don't want to fuck that up. So let's just save game position here as well. Good. And now shift. Yep, shift is the one. Oh shit! Don't know why I bothered doing that. Didn't need it. Thank you, Nix. It'll be here soon, I'm sure. It normally doesn't take too long to get from that place, but uh, sometimes I don't know. Sometimes it'd be like that. Oh, yeah, sorry. I need to <clears throat> switch up Popoy's things. And yeah, we'll, what we'll probably do now, guys, is we're going to go as far as the uh, <coughs> as the witch, I think. And we'll cut it there. And then I don't know, maybe do some jackbox in the in the um in the server or something. <clears throat> no worries, Haley, go write that essay, I believe in you. And we're back in here again. It has been like an hour though since the food was ordered. It should be. I might have to give him a quick call again and see what one.
Oh, there we go. There's the food, one second. Okay. Here we go. Food, foodie, food. Foodie, food. Let's say thank you to Nix when she gets back. this veggie curry. Mm -hmm. What could ever be better? Right. Let's carry on. No, not that. thinking possibly should have a cup of wishes or two. That'll probably be alright. What? Oh, oh! The reason I can't go up is because they're there. And they have the AI of a fucking houseplant. is good. It's true. Right. Lovely! Let's meet at level one on the axe now. Oh, I guess it's time to do the bow. Can't go anywhere there. There's something else we have to do here. Oh shit. Okay, well, no. This might not be the best time for the bow actually because we need to cut through shit. We do probably want the sword to be at level 2 before we take on the witch as well, but we'll see. Hooray! Popeye has reached level 1 boomerang. Oh yeah, it's a great game. It's a classic. I should have equipped him with some armor. It's not so stupid. Oops, no, I don't know if make it, that's no good.
Yeah, you have the axe now, mate. Turtle is in the kitchen. Nice one, Nix. I have I have got my food and it is as gorgeous as I knew it would be. Oh shit! Yeah, we're gonna need to Mind to head back to town. I mean, we can <clears throat> buy the stuff from Nico, but he does charge double, and we could do with quite a few. And we could also go to an inn as well to heal up um, Popoy. Got him. Why the eye makes these chopping hoods appear? Fuck knows. Oh, and she's reached level 2 spear. Nice. Uh, this one? Here we are. You have to boomerang now. Oh, Greek. That sounds nice. Detour. We're going to head back to um, <clears throat> we're going to head back to um, Hippo Kippo Village. Healed up. We're gonna get this. We're gonna get some um, cups of wishes. So this can happen again, basically. Then we're gonna go for it. And it's all the extra cash we're picking up doing this isn't the worst thing either. But yeah, this is actually a multiplayer game. You could play with three people, which was fucking amazing. You know, no one ever made multiplayer RPGs back then. Um, so they also made put a multiplayer function into Final Fantasy VI, which I really liked, but most people didn't. Well, no, more to the point, no one really played Final Fantasy VI multiplayer, so... It was considered obsolete, but... Well, multiplayer Sucre Manor, fucking brilliant fun. Oh, God on my card, she, those fucking migraines have been really fucking with you. Sorry to hear that, mate.
here we go. Yes, many thoughts to you, buddy. Mm. Oh, that is just deliciously fresh. Now, item shop and buy all the fucking cups of wishes. You can only carry four of each item, which is a bit difficult. But hey, yeah, I've got lots and lots of money, so which is good. First. And you know what? Three elbow pads would be a good plan. Or at least, well, two of them at least. process of equipping shit can take a little while, let's be honest. But yeah, best to equip all you can, exactly. I think he can wear this. Yeah, he can. Brilliant. All right, good. Can drop the cloak. Oh, three! Three from buying a new elbow pad. Just be called medical herb in the original translation, but because it's meant to be a particular herb of some sort. Is there a real herb called a shepherd's purse? Maybe there is. We're all a bit better defended now. We've got the ability to come back from death, so that will help us. Now, this time, we're going to kill the fucking witch. We've got to get through the forest and through our castle. It's quite a lot of stuff we've got to get through. Go on, go kill those things. Get some levels, you lazy fuckers. Maybe some sushi. Good kids. Why am I cutting the grass? I don't need to. Okay. Oh, hello. Double that one.
Randy's weapon skill up, hooray! I already just level one. Nice! Right. What haven't I got? Yeah. Alright, just we get the spear to level two. Yeah, you don't get any, you never get anything in Secret of Mana though, sadly, for cutting the grass. Zelda, that's a different thing. Lots of stuff given to you for gardening in Zelda. Right. This time we got you. Yeah, totally. I was playing Link's Awakening back when it was first released on the, on the Game Boy. Not the colour version now. Oh, I played that version too. Very formative game for me, that one. So, seven-year-old Jed was not ready for the existential madness that that thing brought on. There we are, Popoy on level 5 now. Pause while I go with all this lovely food in me. Thanking you again, Nyx. Thank you. Sushi always is fucking hell, it's good. Oops. No. Play as her for a bit, seeing as she's got the sword. You can actually cut through the things. We need a projectile weapon to deal with that douche. We can... You can't reach him, Sprite Boy. He's too far away. You can't actually hit him. Leave him alone. Yep, go for the mushroom. Good idea. Shit, we don't go this way. I forgot. <coughs> oh well. Grim's weapon skill up. Sword level two. Damn right. That goes. Oh, and Popeye's level two up as well. Excellent. Okay. Right, so you. Switch the, the bow. You switch to the knuckles. Nice. Also, because there's nothing that can actually chop anything. Might have to go onto the sword for a bit. It's okay, because we're. Not that too. Come on, then. <laughs> Pa. 
lot of me. That'll be the wasabi cleaning me out. So sorry, Nick. Particularly with, I imagine, the slight delay on one of them. Oh, shit. Sword through this thing. Sword or axe, either will do. This, I think, is. Yep. Here we go. Oh shit! Werewolves are fucking badass. Gotten out. Oh shit! Oh, they literally one shotted Popoy there. Dangerously hard ass. Fuck. Okay, got him. Do -do -do -do. Me my bad for stopping for food there at that moment. Okay, right. Let's carry on, people. Well, that didn't help.
Yeah, taking this guy out before we get to him. Good idea, that. If you can't tell it is. There he is, and as you've seen, these guys are a bit on the hard off side. Nice! Sushi. Oh, for God's sake. That's rude. Right, we're in. I need more bad guys still to come, don't worry. the sword to oh yeah we got chairs that come to life here polter chairs uh yeah soon enough both Prim and Popo are going to be able to use magic. But we've a little way to go still. Is that her reaching level one on the bow? I think it might be. When you get turned to a Moogle, there is literally F all you can do. Except run around. It's quite a lot of status elements that basically mean you can't do anything. I can't remember which one it is we're meant to go to, so let's go left first. Classic dungeon tactics, start by going left. Okay, well this seems to be the right way, so let me just check there isn't something... Yeah, 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 we're going to run past these guys. We're running past them, running past them. Check there isn't something in here. No, it's just chairs. Okay, fuck that. Sometimes there's chests with shit hidden in the dungeons, but I don't know there is any of those for a while. Not until we get to the ruins, at least, I don't think. Now, this is going to be nasty. Two werewolves is a fucking nightmare. God damn it, I missed! Oh no, I got him. Cure watering himself. Exactly, two wells and not a lot of moving space. It's a pretty nasty. Throw us, but yeah. 
Could be 14, true, true, true. 14 werewolves would be a lot of werewolves. Happens there. Ah, oh, here we are. Here's the prisoners. How do I? Oh, I just talked to him, don't I? Dot, dot, dot. We're here to rescue you. Huh? Oh. Where's Dylok? Huh? Maybe where the witch is? I wonder. It's not good. It's like the souls have been ripped out. Just like the people in Pandora. It's the work of the witch after all. Yeah, I, know, I, lo I love it too, Man of East. I think it's great. Well then, I'll head home. Oh, uh, go into where the witch is. On the platform, if three step on, a bridge will come out. Huh? You must mean that platform upstairs. Come up. Yeah, I've been caught. Maybe you can help beg, beg for mercy. Brrr. Personalized service of busy travelers. I can also save for you. Right. Uh, will absolutely be worth our while just stocking up on these, even at the stupid prices he charges. Yeah, possible game. There are mimics in this game. There are chests that will actually attack you. I need to get back to doing more Baldur's Gate at some point, I know. It does add all that little extra stuff in. That's true. And this isn't much of a problem, but I might as well kill them. So I might as well just kill them anyway and get the little bit of money and XP. It would be good if we get the sword to level 2 before we take on the boss of this place, because the boss is a fucking nightmare. I distinctly remember it being one of the hardest bosses in the game. Simply because after this we've got magic. After this boss, anyway, the next boss will have magic for. Excellent, we're at level two. Chairs. It's her level. That. Now, if I remember rightly, she made it to level two spear, so we will switch her to spear when we get to the boss. Soonish. Not. There's more werewolves here, I think, isn't there? I am now at max level of everything, I think, aren't I? It's a proper fucking hit. Level ten. Get in. Very nearly there. I love this different version of it. It doesn't last, sadly. Very cool remix. There she is. You're such fussy little children. Erinice here is going to be played by the actress Maggie Smith. I think you'll remember this lesson for a while. Okay, right, here we go. Um, let's 
So yeah, we're gonna switch you to the spear and you and yeah and hand back to the boomerang because that's the least range for him. Why is it always those three? Yeah. Now then allow me the pleasure of sending you to Master Thanatos like so Dynak! What in the world did you do to him, Erenice? Ha 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 ha, such a peculiar young man. For some reason his lone self wouldn't fall under my spell and gave me so much trouble. I sent it to the ruins of Pandora, as I was instructed by Master Thanatus. Thanatus? He's a magic knight from the Vandal Empire, who's working to crush the kingdom from the inside. What? I'll never forgive you, Erenice! <laughs> Already most of the kingdom's people have been reduced to nothing but walking flesh. They have no resolve whatsoever. Afterwards, Master Thanatus will invade the castle. Why is it always you three, Nicky? It's true. Using the southern ruins as a staging ground, that will be the end. But enough. May I ask you to feed yourselves to my cute little tiger? Here we go. All right, um, something else I was going to do. Oh, yeah, that was it. Um, still not quite what we wanted to do. So we need to do it with the other guy as well. I hate this thing. I hate this guy. Like... Almost all his attacks are unblockable and or unavoidable, and you know, it's really hard to hit him half the time. I mean, what the fuck are you meant to do about that? Ah, oh, shit sticks. Actually, you know what? Since you are on a Avoid an attack, that's your plan. Because you've got a mobile weapon. Oh. Well, he hasn't jumped up onto the fucking things yet. Oh, here we go. Oh, this is quite remarkably unfair. <laughs> Shit, we're out of fucking candy now. We can't... When you're engulfed, you can't do shit, and yeah. Do not like this boss at all. Bring Popo back in a moment. Not right now. Oh, please say that hit him. It didn't. Oh, she did something to him anyway. Oh fuck, here we go again. Um, bring back Popo for now then. Oh, okay, and that's me dead. Yep, okay, good. It is really unfair, this boss. Remarkably unfair. Well, good. Hang on. That I think I can get rid of. Oh, sorry. Switch back. Uh, okay, well that's him done. I think we'll probably just leave Popoy down for now because he's not able to do anything like as much damage as the other two. We've only got one more cup of wishes left. Oh, this fucking thing. I'm not above safe scumming past this shit if I need to. That was possibly a mistake though. Yeah. I think I will use it on her. Oh shit. Oh, wow, okay. Didn't actually do it. But that's the answer. Where is he? Oh, he's up there. Right. Out of the way. 
No, no, he's far breathing us. Oh shit, I don't even have any one of those left now. Uh, okay, come on, come down, you bastard. Again? Really? I mean, what am I meant to fucking do? Extracting the Michael is what you're doing. The urine is being absolutely removed in this situation. Right, she's dead as well. Come on, die, you bastard! Oh, for fuck's sake. No. See what I mean, though? Worst fucking boss in the game. That's it, we're dead. Luckily, we can save scum that, but still. Fucking, fucking bullshit, right? And this is with us reasonably leveled up as well. Bought some more. Ah, oh, dead. Oh. And she's unconscious, so, uh, yep. Absolutely taking the piss over and over again. I mean, it's just all the attacks unavoidable. Half of them make it so you can't actually do anything from it. Oh, we got him! Motherfucker! Thank you! What a cunt! Like I say, yeah, exactly, yeah, Becky. Um, but it's alright. We've beaten him. That is probably the hardest boss in the game. After this point, we'll have magic in the next ones. And we've got the boomerang orb. Hooray! Yippee! Aye, show mercy, please! I'm sorry. Recently, the medicinal herbs that sprout in the forest died out. In exchange for preserving my magical powers, I stripped the will of Pandora's citizens. Once that was done, uh, an artist gave me the herbs I needed. From now on, I'll just be an ordinary old lady and live a peaceful life here. As for that young man from before, he should be in the ancient ruins south of Pandora. I don't know what's in the treasure chests anymore. Please take anything you find. Uh, the orb at the palace of the depths of the earth? Hmm, if you don't have ice magic, there's no way to dissolve it. But now that I'm back to my old self, I don't have that kind of magical power. Fifty GP! Yeah. Well, exactly, I, uh, that's the thing, you know, I, c I could do... I could get back to doing sort of your mid-streams where we do some... Uh, where we just do some grinding, bef but not on the actual Sunday stream. It's a leather whip! Why did you have a leather whip in your chest, woman? Let's, let's maybe not ask that, actually. Can't use it in here for some reason. It's so weird, isn't it? You can use it in every other dungeon, but not here. Anyway, the whip does have a big advantage. With a tiger. Yes, yes, that, that'll be it for the tiger. Oh, you stupid AI of a fucking houseplant, like I say. How am I meant to.
True, yeah. Old lady in a tower, yeah, exactly. What else are you going to do to pass away your time? <clears throat> Besides that annoying boss, it is a wonderful game. <laughs> your name. <laughs> Very nice, Gabe. Probably not the knitting type, exactly. But all you heard was whip. Yes, indeed. We now have a leather whip. It is the next. It is the... Second to last of the weapons. We'll get the last one soon. Dalek is still alive after all, thank God. Randy, canst thou hear me? I pray thee journey to the Water Palace soon. Master Luca, I wonder what's going on. I have to go now. I'm coming too. Dalek is my whole life. Oh, babe, come on. But I can't save him by myself. Decided to go with you guys. But please help me return. Yay! Yay! I'm with you, big sis! I'm in it for the long haul. Leave it to me! Right. So we're going to head towards the Water Palace. I'm going to get out of the forest, basically, and that's when we're going to um, end it, people. Doki, doki, doki. Now the good thing about having the whip is we can now do this. Ah, fuck you! And that'll take us straight to where the water palace is. And that, lovely, beautiful human beings, is where we are going to leave things today. Ah, let's do a bit of a raid, shall we? Who is on? Thank you very much for joining me, guys, as always. Okay, um, let's see who's on and we'll see who we raid. Oh, Avalon's on! Go see Daddy Avalon, everyone. A pleasure, people. Um, more audios on the Patreon coming soon and on YouTube tomorrow. Um, as for now, good night. <laughs>